Castle Infinity being back and like being huge and like and there being like bosses and like all sorts of Oh! You know what I have? You Castle Infinity guys? I have ten I am thinking about the ten of the the packs that they, they sold at Blockbuster for ten bucks, the trial packs. It came with like it was a big long thing, and it came with like a comic book and the C D and the trading cards and stuff. I have a bunch of those. So if, if you guys want one, you could, um, if, if you guys want one, I could, um, hook you up. And I need to stop dying. I remember when, I remember, I don't know, gosh, I remember near the end, right before Castle Infinity died, this was, I guess, around time of Trio Tyranny, and of course the levels I made, the Corridor of Pain, and the Sands of Time. I don't even know if it was public info or not, but I had written some songs that I kind of wanted them to, to offer them to use in the game, and they were going to use one of them. They were going to replace the music in, um, fucking, um, what's it called? Hall of Infinity. Infinity. Called? Club Infinity. They were going to replace it with a song I wrote called Infinity Lounge. And you wrote music too, yes. And you made a level. Oh god, you made a level. Yes. Oh my god, it had a really tricky falling part. Oh my god. It reminded me of like... Of, it reminded me of the... Um, what's it called? The Wookiee Hole from Battletoads. Yeah, your level was awesome, Angela. It had this, like, this totally sick falling part where you had to, like, dodge gears and stuff. It was... Oh, my God. So, Fandred41, did you ever... And, 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 Arlo, did you ever, um... Did you guys ever manage to beat my level, the Sands of Time? And also, of course, the Corridor of Pain before it. Enclosed Marijuana! Yay, Marijuana! Yes, I was really proud of the Seance of Time. God, I loved that level. The Corridor of Pain was just a bitch, though. I, I mean, I made the level- I made Corridor of Pain, even I had trouble with it. But supposedly, when once they installed the heads-up display, it made the level a lot easier. Hey, I just glitched through a wall! Hey, I'm gonna glitch through another wall. This is the glitching through walls level. Yeah, in the corner of pain, you had to be- you had to be fast, otherwise the freaking thing would crush you. And if you guys who don't know what the hell we're talking about, there used to be this online game called Castle Infinity. It was one of the first massive of the multiplayer online games for Windows. And I think probably, definitely the first one, like, for kids. It was a platformer with, like, AIDS. No, it didn't have AIDS, actually. It was the cure for AIDS. It was awesome. And, but it ended up dying because because of infighting and stuff. So let that be a lesson to you people. Be nice, or something. Oh, sorry. Sorry, 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 sorry. Two things about Spencer. Do you remember, um... Does anyone remember Project Alice? That was like Spencer's like big secret, not so secret plan to completely reinvent the castle. I think. 
And of course, there was, there was Dawn in Crepusco. Whoa, I just remembered something. I had a dream about Castle Infinity. I had a dream that, like, that I, Doc Sigma, was the final boss of the game, and I had this spell called Dawn, and what Dawn did was it, like, destroyed the entire castle and, like, attacked you with it. It was basically, like, and the whole thing took, like, five minutes. It was, like, it, uh, it was basically, like, the Castle Infinity equivalent of, like, of, um, what's it called? Um, from Final Fantasy VII. Um, the, the big Sephiroth does, where he, like, destroys the entire solar system just to attack your solar player. Supernova! Oh, Sans Attack? Okay, Binary. There was, um, Castle Infinity was an online, massively multiplayer platforming game, and I made a couple levels for it. The first one was called The Corridor of Pain, and it was basically, like, you had to run to the right while fighting enemies and making really tricky jumps. And you had to go fast because this thing was chasing you. And this jumps because of the AIDS. I wish so too, but I don't even know if the files for them exist anymore. Anywhere. I know I certainly don't have them. And Mario, stop hitting your head. Okay, maybe I don't want to go this way. Maybe I want to go this way. Oh man, I'm the same way! It starts off like all kitty and stuff, but then... Usually, eventually what happens is like you have to like... It turns out that Stella is evil. I don't think I can duck jump, because I have to... I start from water. You sent me videos and stuff, yeah, you sent me a lot of stuff, so I should have it in here. This is killing me. What the fucking hell? Hello. Hello. Yes, I think I shall be little. Let's try that. I was hitting my head, and hitting my head is what was killing me. Fuck it, I want to be small for this. Come on, come here, come on, you know you want to touch me. You want to touch me. Yeah. No, come on, you don't want to rape me. Do you really want to rape me? Do you really want to rape me? Okay, being small didn't fucking help a thing. Okay, yes it did. Never mind. Jesus Christ. Uh, I think I'm going to be doing some fast forwarding. Advice dog. He told me. He told me. That one way, he told me to blast it with piss. So I guess it wasn't actually advice dog. It must have been foul bachelor dog. This level is shaped like the letter X for those who don't notice. What did you miss? Death. Of course. And nothing else. What's your part, Fanny? 
100% orange juice.